Hey, Steve Bedell here, coming to you from sunny Florida with another market report. Great sunny day down here. Today, we're reporting for the, uh, on March 20th report from the week before. So I'll go over a few things with you and tell you just what I think of it. And hey, how about that? My shirt matches the wall. <laughs> Great. Okay, let's go over this. Listings. 363 listings. That is a lot. I thought we were in the 350 or so range before, and now we're up to 363. So the listings just keep on piling up, okay? Price per square foot, $261 a square foot. That's what they're asking on the new homes that have just been listed, that's a median. And I put the 285 here just to give you some kind of frame of reference because at one point, when the market was really hot in the villages, that's where they were at. So you can see it's a pretty significant change there. Medium days on the market is 40 days. That goes up and down every week because sometimes you'll get a few properties that sell pretty quickly. We were about in the 50, 55 range, but lately they have been a little quicker, okay? And new listings, 50. That's the biggest number I've seen in at least a year. 50 new listings. We had 49 last week. So new listings, they just keep coming on the market. Now let's see what's uh, happening with those listings. When we go to pending, we got 43 homes that are pending this week. And when you look, that means we had 50 homes come on, 7 homes go off. So we're still gaining our actual amount of listings that are on the market because they're staying on the market longer than this than they're selling price per square foot 259 which you see is pretty close to this and the price change on these is 5.25 percent so they have gone down uh, over five percent when you compare it to what the original listing price was to when they went pending so that's significant also. Okay, so let's go over here. Under the sold, 20 properties were sold. I put the three to five here because the majority of properties, the hot spot, has been the 300 to 500,000, okay? And if we look at the price per square foot that they were sold for, we're looking at 227. You see the 227 is a very significant drop from the 261 and even the 259. So sold homes, um, sold price. Days on the market, 27 and a half. Again, don't pay a lot of attention to that because that swings up and down uh, quite a bit depending on if you had a few hot sales that week. This is important though. The percentage of homes that sold that lowered their price while it was on the market is over 50%, okay? And the amount of the decrease is 4.7%. So they went on the market at this price, they went, uh, they sold, they decreased the price, and then they sold at a lower price, okay? All right, so that's about all I got for you this week. Things are saying, well, you seem to be in a pretty similar pattern here of uh, more plenty of homes for sale, uh, staying on the market for a little bit, and the inventory just keeps growing because more homes are coming to market than are going off market. Okay? All right. So I hope that helps with you today. I'm Steve. I'm your EXP agent in the Villages, Florida. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll be bringing you more videos every week on market conditions and other areas of interest to you if you're interested in the Villages. Okay? Okay. Till next time.